from the station working for you. This is an RTV6 update. Hello, I'm Matthew McClellan, and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. A polo match fundraiser will help send the family of fallen deputy Jacob Pickett to the nation's capital. The Boone County deputy shot and killed in the line of duty last March. He was chasing a suspect running from police. The 34 year old was the first Boone County deputy killed in the line of duty since 1935. The history uh, Hickory Hall Polo Club in Whitestown hosted the match Saturday. Money raised will go to Pickett's family so they can attend Peace Officers Memorial Day in Washington, D.C. Pickett's name will be put on that memorial. An estimated $17,000 is needed to send Pickett's family to that event in May. And local artists showcasing their work in the heart of downtown Indy Saturday. This is the look at the 4th Monument Circle Art Fair on the Soldiers and Sailors Circle Monument. The attraction draws art lovers from all over Indiana with food, music, and of course, artwork from some talented local craftsmen. The fair is dedicated to promoting artists and culture and historically artistic setting. Kyle. Continuing with our summer feel in October here for the second half of your weekend. Temperatures are going to make their way back into the 80s, 86 degrees in Indy, very close to that record right around 94. So partly sunny skies, still quite a bit of that humidity around and just about a 20% chance of a shower or storm. But things are going to change. We do have some cooler temperatures and much cooler at that on the way. As we look at those highs heading into the weekend, only around 60 degrees. Seven day planning forecast shows that transition marked by thunderstorms on Wednesday. All right, Kyle, thanks for more stories and weather you need to know. Download the RTV6 app. Thanks for joining us.